The Arctic is home to breathtaking glaciers, freezing temperatures, and two of the most formidable survivalists, the polar bear and the walrus. On one side, the polar bear, the Arctic's apex predator with razor-sharp claws and a nose so sensitive it could sniff out leftovers from a mile away. On the other, the walrus, a tusked titan of the sea with enough blubber to make a seal jealous. Who reigns supreme in this icy showdown? Polar bear versus walrus. Meet the polar bear, the largest land carnivore on Earth. This majestic beast can weigh up to 1,500 pounds and stand a towering 10 feet tall when on its hind legs. That's taller than a basketball hoop, folks. And don't let their fluffy appearance fool you. Under that adorable exterior lies a lean, mean, seal-eating machine. Polar bears are expert hunters. Their keen sense of smell can detect a seal under three feet of ice, and their patient stalking techniques would put even the sneakiest ninjas to shame. Oh, and their fur. It's not white, it's transparent. The hollow hairs trap sunlight keeping them warm and making them the ultimate fashion icons of the Arctic. But polar bears have their weaknesses. Despite their size and strength, they're not exactly Olympic swimmers. They can paddle for miles, sure, but they're burning through calories faster than a polar bear in a donut shop. And in the harsh Arctic, food isn't exactly abundant. Now let's talk about the walrus. These blubbery behemoths are built for survival. Weighing up to 4,000 pounds, that's about the size of a mid-sized car. Walruses are basically the tanks of the Arctic. Their tusks are not just for show. These elongated canines, which can grow up to three feet long, are used for hauling their hefty bodies onto ice, fighting off rivals, and occasionally flexing for the gram. And don't forget their whiskers, these super-sensitive facial hair strands, called vibrissae, help them detect clams and other tasty treats buried in the seabed. But walruses aren't just brawn, they're brains too. They're highly social animals, often forming tight-knit herds. Safety in numbers, right? Except when you're trying to nap and your buddy's snoring sounds like a foghorn. Here's where it gets interesting. A hungry polar bear spots a herd of walruses. It's like a buffet, but every dish is covered in armor and armed with tusks. Polar bears prefer to hunt seals. They're smaller, easier to catch, and significantly less stabby. But when food is scarce, a bear might try its luck with a walrus. The polar bear approaches, carefully choosing its target. The key to a successful hunt is isolating a weak or injured walrus. It's the Arctic equivalent of picking the slowest kid in dodgeball. But even a weak walrus is no pushover. Their blubber acts like a protective shield, and their sheer size makes them incredibly difficult to take down. If the bear succeeds in taking down a walrus, it's a feast worthy of a king. But more often than not, the walrus herd bands together, forming an impenetrable wall of blubber and tusks. It's teamwork at its finest. The polar bear realizing it's bitten off more than it can chew, literally retreats to fight another day. 
So who wins the title of Arctic Champion? The polar bear, with its unmatched hunting prowess and raw strength? Or the walrus, the tusk tank with a talent for teamwork? The truth is, it's not about who's stronger or more ferocious. It's about survival. Both animals are perfectly adapted to their harsh environment, each playing a crucial role in the Arctic ecosystem. Polar bears keep the seal population in check, while walruses help maintain the health of the seabed. It's nature's delicate balance. But let's be honest, if there were a prize for most likely to star in a nature documentary, the polar bear would win paws down. Sorry, walrus fans. And there you have it, folks. The Arctic's heavyweight showdown ends in a draw, with both contenders proving they're champions in their own right. Their strength, resilience, and unique adaptations remind us of the wonders of the natural world. Until next time, stay wild, stay curious, and remember that nature always finds a way to keep us entertained. Now, it's time to see how much you've learned from today's episode. We've got three fun trivia questions coming up. Ready? Let's start. Question one. What is the primary prey of polar bears? The correct answer is B, seals. Polar bears primarily hunt seals because they are easier to catch and provide the high fat content needed for energy in the Arctic. Let's move on to the next question. Question two, how do walruses use their tusks? If your answer is D, all of the above, you are correct. Walruses use their tusks for multiple purposes, including climbing, defending themselves, and searching for food. And for our last question, question three, what is a polar bear's fur made of? The answer is B, transparent hair. A polar bear's fur is made of transparent, hollow hairs that trap sunlight and keep them warm. Great job if you've got all three correct. If you missed one, don't worry. Now you know more about the incredible survival strategies of polar bears and walruses two of the most fascinating creatures in the Arctic. Whether it's the polar bear's relentless pursuit of seals or the walrus's ability to withstand freezing waters with its thick blubber, both are true Arctic champions in their own right. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution.